So what's up, you two? It's me, Mandre4. And first of all, I was gonna do a more organized vlog today, but first I must complain about my school's sports boosters club. First of all, I am mad at them. Very mad at them, and so is the entire, or at least all the people of our club who showed up today. Because this is Dan's coming up, right? And between now and then, we only have one art club. That was today. And they expected us to make 72 feet of decoration. We did it, but it was hard and time-consuming and annoying because they didn't really make sure we had all the stuff. We had to, like, go find a bunch of tape and paper and stuff. Yeah, whatever. That's that. I don't know. I'm not going to spend much time on it. Now, back to my topics that I want to talk about. First, politics and YouTube. They should not mix, in my opinion. Because um, YouTube is for fun. I'm wearing a geek guy. Um, YouTube is for fun. YouTube is for entertainment, for internet memes, and so forth. Politics is serious. They don't mix. I don't know. I'm just saying that's why I'm probably never going to talk about politics ever because of that. I don't think anyone should talk about politics on YouTube. News is fine. That's a different thing. But politics, no. Just no. And also, um, while we're talking about YouTube and the fun in it and so forth, is... Ryan Higa, Niga Higa, if you know him by channel name. Um, congratulations, dude, on breaking um, 2 million. That's pretty impressive. First person, I believe. Yeah. So that's cool. And I mean, speaking of sex on YouTube, I hope to obtain somewhat of success with time. Because I really like doing these vlogs. And I mean, it's, it's fun. I mean, because, and I know quite a few, not quite a few, but I know a, that there are definitely some YouTubers that the way they do the videos, I just think it's really cool. And I try to learn from that to do my vlogs. Like, I know Traveler from Info Uplink AK, or, or Household Hacker, I like his style of videos. So, like, I try to, you know, adaptate the personal gaming kind of thing, where he like says, alright, you know, let's play this game. One person has already done that, like I told you guys last video, JP Mall 3R. I told you guys about, about my Benagi, he picked it up, I'm like, cool, what's up, man? Added him on, you know, it's right on there. It's cool. Um, so I try to adaptate that, you know, geeky socialness. I also try to adaptate, I like what Ray William Johnson does on his Breaking NYC thing, where he goes around outside and just films what he does throughout the day. Now, you know, I would do that. I would do what I did throughout the day. But I go to school and I can't really film during school. Just saying. So, I would, but rules are rules. I'm just saying. Um, yeah, so that's that. Um, and also, you know, Sexy Phil, or SXY Phil, whatever. And, you know, his other channels. I like his styles, but, you know, I don't really... I don't know, I just feel like mentioning it like his style because I don't really know what I've learned from his style. I don't know. I guess to keep everything not serious. Speaking of Philip DeFranco and his st vlogging and his jokes, I saw a hilarious thing and I just couldn't help but think of this one shirt he has, the I Make Good Sandwiches shirt, because this one dude at lunch brought like all the parts of a sandwich but not put together for some reason. And this one chick just said, here, I'll make you a sandwich. I'm like, wow, that is like WTF right there. It's like, that is definitely not sexist. Whatever. It's not like he was forced to do it. Whatever. But it looked like it looked like a good sandwich. So, she, uh, like, I'm about to, like, get her freaking so this is, I make her sandwiches just for the LOLs. I don't know. I want to get some Max. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but, yeah. And, like... Like I said, I don't want to be a douche about it, but, you know, please comment and rate and, you know, have your friends subscribe, or if you aren't subscribed yet, subscribe yourself, because, I mean, it's just cool. I'm not doing this so much to get a YouTube partnership. I would like that. That would be really awesome. But I don't vlog in hopes of that. I, ho I vlog in hopes of just, you know, being able to talk to a lot of people on opinions and get feedback and just the whole social aspect of it and you know I kind of want to have one of those like nation 
kind of things. You know how it's the, the Philip the Franco nation and you know the Pogo tribe. You know for Pogo Bat. You know Dan Brown. I just I want one, something like that. It just seems fun to me. But I don't know. Whatever. Um. Yeah. So that's that with that. I need to pick up. <sighs> yeah. So I need to look at something. I don't know. <laughs> Randomness, right? And a couple things to be a couple things to become on my final phone um, is one. I will be as soon as I can be getting myself Final Fantasy, whatever number it is by now. I will probably maybe unbox. I don't know. Probably not actually, and definitely review it. Um, and. I will be hopefully getting a gorilla pod and a pair of Gunnar computer glasses, which I will definitely show you guys and review and so definitely unbox if I get a chance to get, which I think I will be. Um, I don't really know. And also, spring break's coming, so we'll see what kind of interesting things I can do. I might be going to a robotics camp. Yeah, like Total Geek right here. I mean, come on, think geek tie. Of course I'm a geek, but you know, that's awesome. It's awesome. Whatever, so you know, I'm gonna see if I can take my beautiful Kodak ZI8 and you know, you know, take you guys around, see what's going on. Watch you be all confident on Triple Two, I'm like, WTF. Anyway, yeah, so that's that. We're gonna see what else, you know, I can be doing. Get, get you guys some footage and again because I kind of didn't really say it the way I wanted to say it earlier but you know the right commenting and so forth and spreading the word to your friends like I would hug each and every one of you for doing that except that would be kind of gay if you were a dude and kind of impractical just saying but you get the idea and I know you guys are probably thinking, what's up with the crazy tie, gamer man? Why are you wearing this crazy tie? Well, I just got it today in the mail from thinkgeek.com. And I, before I did the vlog, I did an unboxing, and I'll be uploading that first. But if you haven't seen it yet, click on the tie to go see it. I'm going to put an annotation right there. Just click on the tie. Click on it. Click on it. Well, if you're too late... I'll put a link in the doobly doo as well. Um, so yeah, and oh yeah, I was thinking this is one, this is one more last thing I want to say, and then done for today. No more, because I know it's probably going really long. Yesterday, it has occurred to me that I have a hater um, who you know is trying to hate on my vlog and skills. Certain YouTuber Tubsism. I know him IRL in real life for those of you who don't know the law speaks. And he be hating because he know he can't be vlogging or doing videos like I can. So he's like, people only subscribe to you because they feel sorry for him. I'm like, sorry for what, dude? No. No, I rock. Eat it. No. <laughs> anyway, so again, like I told you guys yesterday, go troll him because it's fun and I hate him IRL because I know him IRL. So, um, you can just be mad at me if you like spam his page, whatever. I don't care. Um, so, yeah, and that's why I wore this shirt for all the haters out there. It says, get a life, and get a life. I also need to get one of those shirts that says, I love haters, because they do. I, I do. When people hate, I'm like, I'm going to show you up now. And also, I'm officially going to be making, as soon as I can, a Twitter and Facebook page for my page on this my channel um so yeah again i want to give you a chance a chance to click on the tie to see the unboxing but you too you too slow by so yeah till next time it's your man j4 see you guys